Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So once again, it's time to have a quick look at the latest survey results and test results by AV Test for the different antivirus products for home users. Now, um, the last video I did post was about a month ago where we had a look at the August results for this year. And uh, this month we're taking a look at their latest, which is for October. Now, as I mentioned in that previous video, which I'll leave a link to in the description, um, they used Windows 11 in August for the first time to conduct their test results. And uh, a Microsoft Defender actually was one of the antivirus products to, to come last on Windows 11 when it came to AV test um, conducting that survey, which is a bit concerning as... It is the default antivirus product and solution on both Windows 10 and Windows 11. But for the month of October, it um, has done a little bit better. As yeah, you can see, they are using Windows 10 once again for October to conduct their different test results. Now, just a quick recap as to how AV Test um, does get to these different uh, survey results for the different antivirus products. They ran continuous tests during September and October this year on different um, antivirus security products, 19 in total. And that was using their default settings. And they also used the most current publicly available version of all the different antivirus products for testing. And uh, they also allowed them to update themselves at any time and query their in-cloud services. So these are online tests that have been conducted and not offline tests. And they say they focused on realistic test scenarios and challenge the products against real world threats. Now, as I always mention with these different survey results, um, they, they give us a good indication, but they will never be 100% accurate. So always just keep that in mind. Now, um, the tests are broken up into three categories, protection, performance, usability. You can get six out of six in each category, giving you a total score of 18. And if we just head down to Microsoft Defender, uh, here we go, Microsoft Defender. Um, it didn't get the top product award on Windows 10, but it did get the AV Test Certified Award, which is not bad. And um, if we just take a look at the test results quickly um, for Microsoft Defender, for protection, got uh, 6 out of 6. For performance, 5 out of 6. And for usability, 6 out of 6. Now for August, when they uh, tested Defender on Windows 11, it received 5.5 out of 6 for protection, 4.5 for performance, and a total of 6 out of 6 for usability. So it seems that on both Windows 10 and 11, there is an issue, according to AV Test, when it comes to the performance of Microsoft Defender on Windows 10 and Windows 11. And uh, as mentioned, for Windows 10, got 5 out of 6. So obviously, there is a bit of a problem there. But nonetheless, a AV Test Certified Award is not bad. And um, although it didn't get the top product, did a lot better on Windows 10 than it did on Windows 11. And just to take a quick look at some of these, they did get 6 out of 6. Um, Avast got 6 out of 6. AVG got 6 out of 6. Avara got 6 out of 6 in all the different categories, giving them a total score of 18. And... Uh, um, that's just a quick summary of some of them. McAfee got 18 points, a full score. Norton got a full score. Uh, I don't think there's any others down here, but that just gives you a rough idea, but not bad. Um, as Microsoft Defender is a free antivirus product that does come installed on both Windows 10 and 11. And as I always say, um, with um, Microsoft Defender, I've been using it for years now. And I always say that if you are an average home user running Windows 10 and 11 and you practice good computing habits and you don't visit dodgy sites or um, download pirated software, um, there is no reason why Microsoft Defender will not get the job done on Windows 10 and 11. And if you are spending money as a home user um, for antivirus products and solutions, I personally feel you are wasting your money. But nonetheless, just wanted to update you, October 2022, um, Microsoft Defender has scored 17 out of 18 and did a lot better on Windows 10 than it did on Windows 11. So thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one.